Hello everyone, my name is Alex and I'm one of the product specialists here at LaserLines. So today we're just going to walk you through the workflow process of how easy it is to use the J55 PolyJet printer. Stratasys have developed an augmented reality app which can be downloaded from the App Store straight onto your phone to be able to visualize the printer into your offices. Compared to other PolyJet printers, the J55 materials cabinet is fitted right under the built envelope, which makes it very, very compact for an office environment. So to replace the cartridge is very easy. You just open the door, press the clamp and remove the material out. And then to put it back in, you just slide it in and there it's back in place. So now that we had a look at the materials, they are all in place. What we're gonna do next, we're gonna set the parts up in GrabCAD on the computer and we're gonna start printing the first parts. We're gonna open up GrabCAD print now to set up the file to be printed. So we will go to file next, open projects, pick the file that we're looking at printing open it up so the parts have now loaded this is how they are going to be positioned on the build platform now what we're going to do we are going to demonstrate Pantone so we have selected the shell that we're looking at changing the color went to the Pantone mode and now let's say we're picking one of the yellow colors now you can see that part has changed into the yellow mustard color we picked. Once all this is done, we will go to estimate the time that's going to take for the part to print. Now it's come up with three hours and 10 minutes and you can also see how much material and support material it's going to use. So once we've seen all this, we close it down, press print, continue, and now our job is being sent to the printer. Okay, so now the part has been set up, it's been sent to the printer. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna go to the printer and just press print. So we're gonna access the queue. The part is already here. We'll click on it and then press print. Make sure the build tray is clear and close the door, which it is. Okay. Okay, so the J55 is stopped printing. What we're gonna do is we're gonna open up the door and just scrape the parts of the build platform. So we remove the part of the build platform. What we're gonna do next, as you can see, the part is covered with a jelly type support. We're gonna to go to the water jet machine and remove all the support off. J55 is part of our PolyJet 3D printers range. PolyJet 3D printing uses liquid polymer, which is then cured by a UV lamp. This, this technology allows you to print parts that look and feel like the real thing. So what's different with J55 compared to the rest of the printers, it has a rotational built platform and a static head. This makes the printer extremely quiet and although it seems very small, you can actually print very large parts like this one we have here. This also allows the printer to be very quiet, approximately 53 decibels, which is actually lower than me talking to you right now. So this printer was specifically designed to go into, um, into any office or a classroom to allow designers to print starting from draft grey, which is just a draft of the concept, a more detailed concept, and finally, you can print the CMF model 
and due to the Pantone validation of the printer, it will ensure that the prototype would be the same color as your final concept. What you can also do on the printer is print with Veroclear, which is a very good material if you have the requirement to print any transparent parts or any glass, glass stimulating type parts. The other things that you could do with the J55 is print textures like a stone texture, wood texture, leather and even fabric and many more other textures. What's also very very interesting about the J55 is that you can actually print with black without having a black cartridge inside the printer. Or you can print different assemblies, for example this speaker was all printed at the same run and you can see it looks like the final product with very good details, all the writing on the speaker. Thank you for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you would like to have more information, uh, please get in touch with us via our website. We'd love to see you face to face and show you the technology or even a virtual meeting. Thank you very much.